So I was thinking about Alzheimer's and how there's been studies of the brain in Alzheimer's patients that state that the brain is often found to have aluminum and other metals within it and that the actual brain itself has become porous. So what if Alzheimer's actually starts at the synaptic cleft? What if at the brain where the memories are formed, where they're kept, the points, the junctions in between are actually slowly being stretched apart and it's losing a chemical in the body that creates elasticity for the neurons themselves and the actual brain mesh that comes together is coming apart in such a way that it's not a memory problem it's an inability to appropriately fire the brain itself sort of like okay my lawnmower has a spark plug in it and that spark plug gap lets me fire that spark plug in order to create combustion and that spark plug if the gap is too far away it won't fire correctly it's not that it won't fire at all it just won't fire correctly and then if it's too close it'll fire in such a way that it'll fry if your synaptics are too close then perhaps you'll have something different but as you get older if you have a loosening of that synapse for your memory then perhaps that loosening is a disjointment between what you remember and what you're able to electrochemically bring forward from your memory if that were the case it would be really important to understand the energy flow of the brain as the brain is a very powerful muscle that relies upon energy to fire appropriately and perhaps there is some type of electrical chemical imbalance that is common among those that get Alzheimer's. Now I'm not saying that you're going to get the memories back or that once you get Alzheimer's that you're going to be able to you know become but if we were able to identify early on that your brain is losing its ability to maintain a charge like a battery and that charge could be enhanced then maybe we could prevent Alzheimer's it's just a different way to look at it that I don't know if anybody's actually researching so if they are that's great and if they're not maybe you should go that route any route is a good route God bless God